Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're gonna show you how to find all 23 field guide pages here in the South Wing in Hogwarts Legacy. So without further ado, let's jump into it. So your first page is gonna be found over here in the South Wing. We're gonna go down here and take the Clock Tower Courtyard Flu Flame. And after taking this Flu Flame, as soon as you spawn in, if you turn right, you guys will see these gates here. We're gonna go inside the gate and right here, you'll have a statue. To grab this one, we're just gonna use Leviosa. You can lock onto it, go ahead and use that spell and you'll be able to get your first field guide page. Now, after grabbing this page, we're gonna turn around, go back outside the gate, and over here, we'll have a massive gate that'll lead outside. So we'll head outside, and you guys will see this giant statue here in the middle of this quad. We're gonna go on the back side of it, and when you get to the other side, just go ahead and use Revelio, and you'll find your second page right here. Now, our third page is gonna be a moth frame. So we're gonna head back inside, once the gate opens up, head back inside and turn left. And we're going to go in this door here. Now, there's a level one lock on this door, so you have to unlock that first. But once doing that, you can go inside and you guys will see our moth frame on the wall here. Just use Lumos. It'll light it up. And to get the butterfly or the moth, rather, we're going to go right back outside. Once the gate opens up, we're going to take a right. And right over here in this corner is going to be our moth location. So we can grab our moth here. We'll head back inside. Go back inside the door here and go ahead and throw your moth in the frame. And once you do so, you'll be able to get your next page. Now, after finishing your moth frame, we're going to head back outside the door into the clock tower courtyard here. And all we're going to do is look up. There's going to be a page that's flying around. You guys can see it right there. We'll lock onto it, use Accio, and we'll be able to get our next page. Now to get our next couple pages, we're going to take the south wing here and we're going to click on the hospital wing flu flame. So go ahead and take that flu flame. And once doing so, instead of actually going into the hospital wing, we're going to turn around and go back toward the clock tower courtyard. We just want to be on the very top. And essentially, we want to go behind these gears to that giant window. So we'll go down the stairs on the right here, all the way down to this little section. And then you guys will see some more stairs back here that will lead up to this giant window. And once climbing these stairs right here, turn around and use Revelio facing the gears and you'll be able to get your next field guide page. Now, after grabbing this one, all you have to do is look to the right. You guys will see we have one of those statues on the wall. So we can come down here and what we'll want to do is use Confringo. So we'll use Confringo on that statue. It'll send out another page and then we can use Accio to pull that page in. So there you go. There's your next two pages. Now to get our next few pages, we're going to head back over to the hospital wing. So you can take the hospital wing flu flame or you can just run back up the stairs from where we were at the last page. But once you get here, you'll spawn in in front of this green unicorn. Go ahead and use Revelio and you'll get your first page right here in front of the unicorn. Now after grabbing this page, we're going to head into the hospital wing and we will have a flying page. So this one's pretty hard to miss. You guys can see it right here. We'll just use Accio to pull that in. And now you've got your next page. Now, after grabbing this page, we're going to turn around and head back toward the flu flame. And when we take a right here at the flu flame, you guys will see that we have a spiral staircase going down. At the bottom of the staircase, we'll have another statue to which you can use Leviosa. And you'll be able to get your next page. Now, after grabbing the page from this statue, if we turn around, you guys will see a little door here that's going to lead into a bathroom. We can go in this bathroom and on the left side, we'll have this giant mural. Go ahead and use Revelio in front of this mural and you'll be able to get your next page. Now, after grabbing this page in the bathroom, we're going to turn around and head right back outside the door. And as soon as you leave the door to your left, you'll see this gold statue. Go ahead and use Revelio in front of the statue and your next page will be right here. Now, after grabbing the page at the statue here, we're going to head down the spiral staircase right next to it. And as we head down the staircase, once we get to the bottom, go all the way down, you guys will see a turtle shell. All we're going to do is use Revelio in front of the turtle shell here and you will get your next field guide page. Now, after grabbing the page in the turtle shell, all we have to do is literally just look left. And right here in this area, we're going to have another flying page. So you can lock onto it, use Accio, and that will be your next page. After the flying page, to get our next one, we're going to do a complete 180. And right here next to the turtle shell, we'll have a door with a level three lock on it. Once you unlock that lock, come inside and you'll see a fireplace directly in front of you. We're going to use the spell Glacius on this fireplace. And once the fire goes out, we can go inside. We're then going to head up these stairs here. And when we get to the top of the stairs, we're going to enter a room. So we're at the top. We enter this room. You guys will see we have a little overlook here. And this is where our next statue is going to be. So you can lock onto the statue, use Confringo, and it will shoot out your next field guide page. Now to grab your next page, we're going to go back over to the South Wing flag. And we're going to come down here and take the Faculty Tower Flu Flame. Now, after taking that flu flame, you'll spawn in in a hallway. We're just going to head straight all the way to the back. You guys will notice paintings on the right hand side. 
At the very end, there's going to be a bull here. If you use Revelio in front of this painting, you will get this page. If you're in the Gryffindor house, this is the very first page that you get when you start the game. So you may already have this one, but if you don't, it'll be right here in front of this painting. Now, after grabbing this page, we're going to do a 180 and we're going to go up this spiral staircase. So we'll head up this staircase behind us. And when you get to the top, we're going to take a left. And all the way at the end, you guys will see a painting of a lady, which is actually the entrance to the Gryffindor common room. We'll go ahead and use Revelio and you'll be able to get your next page here. Now, after grabbing this page, all we're going to do is turn around and head back down the spiral staircase. So if we come back over here, we're going to go down two flights of the spiral staircase. Go back down one floor and we're going to go down to the next floor. And once you get to the bottom here, you'll have one more set of stairs. And after taking these stairs, we're going to go straight all the way to the back here. And you guys will see this map on the wall. If you use Revelio in front of the map, you'll get your next page right here. Now, after grabbing this page, we're going to turn right, go down the stairs, and we'll take another right. And in this little corner here, we'll have a statue. We'll use Revelio in front of the statue to get our next page. And after grabbing that page, we're just going to do a 180, turn around, and you guys will see the statue in this corner. We'll lock onto that and use Confringo, which will then pop out our next field guide page. Now, after grabbing this page in the statue, we're going to turn around and head back up the stairs toward the map on the wall. Now, if you haven't already unlocked this, you can lock onto this button right here and use Depulso, and that will unlock this as a door. And once you do that once, it'll open every time you get near it. And when you walk inside in the back left here, you're going to have another moth frame. So go ahead and use Lumos on the moth frame if you haven't already. We're going to head back outside the door and take a left, go down the stairs, and then we're going to take another left. And we're going to go into the first door on our left here, which is a bathroom. And the moth is going to be, again, on our left. So walking in, you can use Lumos. The moth will get on your wand. You can head back outside, back to the right, and go back into this door, which will open automatically when you get near it. And then you can just throw this moth in the frame that's in this room. And once doing so, you'll be able to get your next page. Now, after finishing this moth frame, we're going to head back to the bathroom where we got the moth. So go back out the door, take a left down the stairs take another left and you guys can see the bathroom that we went into. We're going to go to the next bathroom. So there's a door over here in front of this door, use Revelio and you'll get your next page right here in front of this door. Now to get your next page, we're going to head back over to the faculty tower flu flame. So click on the South wing, come down here to the faculty tower flu flame and take that. And after taking that, we're going to head down the hallway and we're going to take our first door on the right. Now after going through this door, we're going to head up the first flight of stairs here. Take a left, go up the next stairs. And once you get to the top, we're gonna take a right. And this first door is gonna have a level two lock on it. One un Once unlocking that lock, go inside and take a right. And in this back room, there's gonna be some bookcases back here. You can go ahead and use Revelio and you'll get your next page right here. Now to get your final field guide page for the South Wing, we're actually gonna take the grand staircase flag and we're gonna come down here and take the quad courtyard flu flame. Now, after taking this flu flame, we're going to work our way up the stairs directly in front of us. You will probably see some other field guide pages in here, but the only one that counts toward the south wing is the one at the top of the stairs here, which is a statue. We can use Leviosa on this statue, and once doing so, you will get your final field guide page. But this is how to get all 23 field guide pages here in the south wing in Hogwarts Legacy. If you guys have any questions, make sure to leave them down in the comment section below, and I'll see you guys in the next video.